WWE's female storylines in the past would definitely have gotten them in trouble today in the PG era. I'm Jeremy, and here are five scandalous female storylines that could get WWE canceled. Number five, Stephanie gets body shamed. On the August 13th, 2001 episode of WWE Raw, The Rock and Chris Jericho teamed up to verbally roast Stephanie McMahon. Rhino and Booker T were there with Stephanie too, but the billion dollar princess bore the brunt of The Rock and Y2J's insults. They made fun of Stephanie's breast implants plants with Jericho roasting McMahon ruthlessly. For instance, while mocking Stephanie, Jericho said, you're the breast. The Rock also did a rhyme throwing shade at Stephanie. Meanwhile, McMahon was so embarrassed that she didn't have anything to say other than shut up. Some fans would argue that one of Raw's greatest segments was this, but demeaning a woman on live television to this extent would likely get WWE canceled today. Number four, Lita's miscarriage. Former women's champion and WWE Hall of Famer Lita had her fair share of questionable storylines. Most fans Fans remember the real-life saga of the Matt Hardy Edge Lita love triangle in 2005, but the Kane Lita romantic storyline that preceded it was even more horrible. From Kane kidnapping Lita to forcibly impregnating her, it had all kinds of horrendous angles, but nothing screamed uncomfortable more than Lita eventually suffering a miscarriage on live television. This happened on the September 13th, 2004 episode of Raw when Kane fell on Lita after being hit by Gene Snitsky. After a few months, Lita then was begin her real life affair with Edge, which then put an end to the storyline with Kane. We certainly cannot imagine top stars like Bianca Belair or Becky Lynch participating in these kind of segments. Number three, Mae Young gives birth. As head scratching as it sounds in the late 1990s, Mark Henry got involved in a romantic storyline with Mae Young. You thought the story of a 20 something Henry romancing a woman in her 80s was controversial enough? We've got some bad news! For allegedly spending a few nights together, Mae announced to the WWE Universe that she was pregnant with Henry's child. One night, Viscera, who at the time was feuding with Henry, landed a splash on the pregnant Mae Young. The veteran superstar then went into labor and was seen backstage giving birth to a single hand. Yes a human hand. Uncomfortable storylines like these could easily get WWE in trouble today. Number two, HLA. On the September 9th, 2002 episode of WWE Raw, General Manager Eric Bischoff came up with a segment called Hot Lesbian Action to compete with SmackDown's gay wedding between Billy Gunn and Chuck Palumbo, which raised the ratings on the blue brand. All night long, Jerry Lawler and other WWE superstars kept building up to the segment by discussing the idea of a woman kissing another woman. During the segment, they brought out two women which were instructed to join Bischoff as he stood in the center of the ring. They began to strip down and started making out. After some time, three-minute warnings showed up and brutally attacked the women. Not only was this disrespectful towards the LGBTQ plus community, it also was blatantly objectifying and it was a sexist angle that definitely should have been avoided. Number one, Trish barks like a dog. Back in 2001, Vince McMahon forced Trish Stratus to strip down to her undergarments in the middle of the ring and bark like a dog. Why, you ask? Well, during that time, Vince was facing marital difficulties with his wife, Linda McMahon, as part of a storyline. Mr. McMahon then filed for divorce, which led to Linda having a breakdown. Fans then witnessed the former WWE chairman begin a romantic angle with Trish Stratus as she became Mr. McMahon's mistress. After some time, Vince grew tired of playing with his toy, and then on the March 5th, 2001 episode of Raw, he ordered Stratus to perform the humiliating act. The boss ordering an employee to strip down and bark like a dog is unimaginable, and it resulted in Linda McMahon facing criticism from her political opponents in the 2010 Senate run. And that's our video for today. If you enjoyed it, like the video, drop a comment, and share it with your friends. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel, Russell Binge by Sportskeeda.